Hello boxing fans, let's talk about the boxer who got destroyed inside the ring. On July 12, 2014, the former WBA World Heavyweight Challenger Matt Skelton with 28 wins, 23 knockouts, and 8 losses from the United Kingdom faced the undefeated and hard hitter Anthony Joshua with 6 wins and 6 knockouts from the same country, the United Kingdom. Skelton and Joshua will fight for the six rounds bout in the heavyweight division. In the first round, Skelton absorbed heavy punches coming from Joshua. He's going to be throwing some punches if this goes any distance. That... 47 years old. Fight from Joshua. Oh, great shot. Oh, Skelton took that. Warning sign from Anthony Joshua. And then... Five up. In the second round, Skelton continues to absorb heavy punches coming from Joshua. You know, a huge hit. Taking his time. That good to right hand again. He followed up with a left immediately, and Skelton took it very well. Andy Moore knows going to take the, the punch. Less than a minute into the round, Skelton was down on the canvas with massive punches to the head coming from Joshua. Joshua looked to land the right hand, but he's taking his time and measuring it up, and that right hand did the damage. He just waited to pull the trigger on that right hand, and that little split second. Skelton was able to make his feet. However, he absorbed another heavy punches, and referee Steve Gray has seen enough and waved the fight off, declaring Joshua a winner via technical knockout in round two. Two rounds for Joshua, takes his time, measures him up again, Skelton's all over the place, Steve Gray says that's it. Skelton was destroyed by Joshua in two minutes and 33 seconds in the second round, with massive punches to put Skelton down on the canvas and stoppage in the second round. But it just shows you that the power that Joshua possesses, that's terrific. And then you can see the point, you know, it was, it was the body language that convinced